Ralph here, and welcome to True Power Trumpet Fitness here on wonderful Wednesday here in Connecticut. Life's good, man. Life is good. Not only do double C's abound, but the weather is cooperating. I don't know if you can tell from the window and whatnot. The sun is out. It's going to be in the uh, upper 30s. It's just a beautiful, beautiful winter day here in Connecticut. Anyway, you saw the thumbnail. Double pedals a la Jerry. Lots of ways to do pedal tones, guys, and I don't agree with a lot of them, nor did Jerry. So let me, uh, let me explain, and we will uh, we'll get to it. Uh, I've not played yet today. I just did some kettlebells. Uh, kettlebell routine outside. And... Towards that end, my book will be out, KBs for Double Cs, uh, any day now. I'll let you know. You'll be the first to know. Anyway, let me honk, and we will get to it. Which uh, pedal notes, which I'm not thrilled about, and I'll let you know about that. And finishing, no noodling around, going right to the E flat trumpet and playing the high knee chair. Let me get my horn. Hang on. different ways to do pedal tones. Jerry used to do them ad nauseum. He got away from them the last, I'm going to say, 8, 10, 12 years of his life, and um, he felt he didn't need them. What we were doing in the regular register, he felt he didn't need it to relax the corners. Back in the day, he used to have a, uh, I'll call them a lit massage. Okay? And you know what? Let me start with the single pedals, because he disagreed with doing any work on the single pedals as well. I disagree big time with um, all the time that Claude Gordon and some of these um, um, methods, uh, the amount of volume of time that they spent in the single pedal register. Now, this does not happen work good this close to the um, laptop. But I will do my best, and I hope the, uh, the sound doesn't get distorted. Okay? Now, the single pedal, as you know, starting with the F right below our regular F sharp, all you're doing is coercing the lips to go flat. That's literally all you're doing. And you notice what I said, coercing the lips. Coercing takes tension in the lips, and for that reason alone, I, I like to stay away from it. Okay, But if your chops are relaxed, the corners, 100% of the time, those single pedals should pop out no problem. No problem at all. Okay, 
I never practice single pedals. Now you notice, I was coercing, testing, one, two, three, can you hear me? I was coercing the lips to go flat. Now, if you listen to all, not all of them, but especially Liberati, I can't, I can't hear enough of this, guys. They had such a liberal use of single pedals that it was extraordinary. Extraordinary. Beep, boom, beep, boom. I mean, the guy was so relaxed. That's why he could tongue the way he did. That's why each note popped, blah, blah, blah. The double pedal C are a completely different animal. Now, Jerry agreed with me. Stay away in bulk from the single pedals, okay? But the reason why, why he developed the double pedals is because it's a completely different armature. You're back down, I mean, in the realm of a trombone, okay? Now, what you're doing is this. You are unrolling the lip like so, okay? You're unrolling the bottom lip and you are literally <coughs> placing the mouthpiece on the bottom lip. The bottom lip is not in the cup. It's just supporting the top lip. And then you blow very, very easily. If you feel like you have to overblow, blow harder than just a little bit to make the lip vibrate, your lips are too tight. Okay, now that, that's a good, good uh, uh, yardstick about tension in the ribs. Now, he had three variations, well, one regular and two variations. He had just doing the single pedal, the double pedals, just like I did. Going down chromatic, don't try to talk, articulate, slur. Okay, it's a complete and total lip massage. Okay, then you go to 1A. You go through all the chromatics starting on middle C, just relaxing, letting your lips go and flop down to the double pedal. Now, if you are a guy that uses a dry mouthpiece. For this um, exercise alone, you might want to wet the mouthpiece so you can slide. You know, the lip gets stuck if I want to do a dry mouthpiece, okay? just as resonant and full as the middle register, okay? And that is what you do, you go right from the C, all valve combinations down the F sharp and flop down. The other one, that's variation one, variation two is what I just did, going from the double pedal and a constant rip up, just pull your lips in, and you go up to the double C if you can. Now, What's going to happen with that one that goes up? It is going to feel, you're going to get to a point, unless you're really good at it, it's going to get to a point where your chops feel like they're stuck. You can't go any farther. Why? Because you are not, it, it prohibits you from using the corners. Okay? So if you're getting stuck like that, at that point you are using the corners. Now you notice I went right up to the double C because I, I don't use the corners, so I can just go right up from the you know, double pedals. All right. So it does a couple things. It gives you the lip massage, and it lets you know if you're depending on the corners to take the rhythm. Otherwise, it should just be up, oh, yeah, like Liberati, just constant rips up and down. There's, as long as you can breathe, there should be no, and it completely 100% completely takes the corners out of the picture. Now, as I said, we got away from that after a while. 
Jerry and I still do it because for so many years, it was just such an integral part of what we did that I just do them, if you look at my videos, I do them and they don't even think about them. Okay? Vacchiano didn't want to hear him. Mel said, you know, Ace, if you can't sell it, you probably don't want to play it. He didn't like me. He says, nobody wants to listen to that shit. I felt there was a need for it at the time. I don't use them anymore in a strict sense of warm up or anything like that. I do resort to them without thinking about it after a while. All right? Now, a couple of my students asked me about the double pedals, and that is the way I feel about it. They are not, absolutely do not need them. If you try a couple of those exercises that I just said and it seems to work, throw them in. Throw them in. But that is why what Jerry initially knew that he had. He was just fooling around in front of the mirror once, and sure enough, he went from the double pedal up to the double C without using his chops and his corners and see that's it. He got it. So that was the impetus, but he did get away from it later on. All right? All right. Anyway, eat and drink fruits and vegetables and live your life with true power. Love you all.